How important is it to get happiness in your life? Happiness is something we all strive for, but it can often feel elusive. In this video, we will explore some practical tips and strategies that can help you cultivate a sense of lasting happiness in your life. Number five, acceptance. The first step towards being happy all the time is to practice acceptance. This means accepting yourself as you are, with all your flaws and imperfections. It also means accepting the world around you, with all its ups and downs. When you can accept things as they are, without trying to change them, you can experience a sense of peace and contentment. Acceptance is often the foundation for building a happier life. It can be challenging to accept ourselves as we are, especially when we are bombarded with messages telling us to be perfect, successful or beautiful. However, accepting ourselves doesn't mean we are giving up on self-improvement or growth. Rather, it means acknowledging that we are human and imperfect, and that is okay. Similarly, accepting the world around us means acknowledging that life is full of ups and downs and that we cannot control everything. We can't always control external circumstances, such as the weather or other people's actions. But we can control our response to these situations. When we can accept things as they are, we can shift our focus towards the things we can control, such as our thoughts and actions. This can help us feel more empowered and less stressed. Practicing acceptance can also help us build more fulfilling relationships with others. When we accept others as they are, we can accept their unique qualities and perspectives rather than trying to change them. This can lead to deeper connections and more meaningful relationships. Number four, gratitude. Another key ingredient to lasting happiness is gratitude. Taking the time to appreciate the good things in your life can help you focus on the positive and feel more fulfilled. Make a habit of writing down things you are grateful for each day, no matter how small they may seem. This can help shift your mindset towards a more positive outlook. Incorporating gratitude into your life can have a profound impact on your overall happiness and well-being. When we focus on the good things in our lives, it can help us feel more positive, optimistic and content. Gratitude can also improve our relationships, boost our immune system and reduce stress and anxiety. One way to cultivate gratitude is to make a habit of writing down things you are grateful for each day. This practice can help you shift your focus towards the positive aspects of your life, even when things may feel challenging or difficult. It's important to remember that gratitude doesn't have to be reserved for major milestones or accomplishments. Even the smallest things, like a good cup of coffee or a kind word from a friend, can be reasons to feel grateful. Another way to incorporate gratitude into your life is to express it to others. Take the time to thank the people in your life who have made a difference, whether it's a family member, friend or co-worker. Simple acts of kindness and appreciation can go a long way in strengthening relationships and creating a positive, supportive community. Gratitude can also help us shift our perspective during challenging times. When we are facing difficult situations or setbacks, it can be easy to focus on what's going wrong. However, by focusing on what we are grateful for, we can reframe our thoughts and find the strength to persevere. Incorporating gratitude into your daily life doesn't have to be complicated or time-consuming. It can be as simple as taking a few minutes each day to reflect on the good things in your life or expressing your appreciation to someone else. By making gratitude a habit, you can cultivate a more positive and fulfilling outlook on life. Number three, mindfulness. Practicing mindfulness can also help you find happiness that lasts. Mindfulness involves paying attention to the present moment without judgment. When you are mindful, you can fully enjoy the good things in your life and let go of the worries about the past or future. Try incorporating a few minutes of mindfulness practice into your daily routine, such as taking a few deep breaths or going for a walk in nature. In today's fast-paced world, it's easy to get caught up in the hustle and bustle of daily life. We often find ourselves worrying about the past or future, instead of living in the present moment. This is where mindfulness comes in. Practicing mindfulness can help us stay grounded and present, leading to a greater sense of happiness and fulfillment. One way to practice mindfulness is to simply take a few deep breaths and focus on the sensations in your body. This can be done anywhere, whether you're sitting at your desk or waiting in line at the grocery store. 
by taking a few moments to slow down and breathe, you can release tension and feel more centered. Another way to incorporate mindfulness into your life is to spend time in nature. This can be as simple as taking a walk in the park or sitting in your backyard. As you take in the sights, sounds and smells of nature, try to let go of your thoughts and simply be present in the moment. Number two, connection. One of the most important factors for lasting happiness is a connection with others. Make time to cultivate relationships with friends and family and seek out opportunities to connect with others in your community. Volunteering or joining a group that aligns with your interests can be a great way to meet new people and find a sense of purpose. Humans are social creatures and we thrive on connection and community. Studies have shown that having strong relationships with others is one of the most important factors for lasting happiness and well-being. However, in our busy lives, it can be easy to neglect our social connections. One way to cultivate a connection with others is to make time for meaningful relationships with friends and family. Set aside regular time to spend with loved ones, whether it's through phone calls, video chats or in-person visits. By prioritizing these relationships, you can strengthen your sense of community and feel more supported and fulfilled. Another way to connect with others is to seek out opportunities to meet new people and get involved in your community. This can be through volunteering, joining a club or organization, or attending events that align with your interests. By engaging with others who share your passions and values, you can create a sense of belonging and purpose. Number one, self-care. Finally, self-care is essential for lasting happiness. Take time to care for your physical and emotional well-being, whether that means getting enough sleep, eating a healthy diet, or engaging in activities that bring you joy. When you prioritize self-care, you can better manage stress and feel more content in your daily life. Self-care is the practice of taking care of oneself, physically, emotionally, and mentally. It is a vital component of lasting happiness because it helps us maintain balance and overall well-being. When we prioritize self-care, we are better equipped to manage stress and navigate life's challenges. One aspect of self-care is taking care of our physical health. This includes getting enough sleep, eating a healthy and balanced diet, and engaging in regular exercise. When we prioritize our physical health, we not only feel better, but also have more energy and resilience to handle whatever comes our way.